as you can see the fuel rate over here is 107.41 now we are going to fill the fuel in the aprilia r r rs457 full tank dal do hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to talk about the most interesting topic topic about the rs457 that is what is the mileage of this beast i know in all my previous videos you guys have been bombarding me with all these questions asking about the mileage bro please tell me what is the mileage that this bike gives and today i am going to reveal that i know when you buy a motorcycle of worth rupees 5 lakhs you don't really don't care about the mileage even it does not matter to me what the mileage gives but most of you folks who have planned to buy this motorcycle probably you are in early phase of your career and you have planned to buy this bike on emi and then uh, when you have put so much money on the down payment paying the emis and then putting the petrol it definitely pinches you a lot and it is very important for all of you to know the mileage of this bike so i respect all of you guys and that's the reason why this is the video that i will be talking about the mileage to calculate the mileage i am going by the full tank method till now i have done two full tanks on this bike and in the second full tank which i did yesterday i did the mileage calculation the reason why i did not go with 1 liter of petrol that is because that 1 liter of petrol really does not give you a realistic number when you go with the full tank number then it is an average out of all the conditions that you have ridden so to give you a background of how i rode it in the last full tank is i took it to the to my office for 3 days and 100 kilometers i rode it near my home probably on the highways you can consider so this is a realistic mileage that you can expect from the rs457 where is a good where there is a good chunk of city riding and some amount of highway riding as well you can consider 60% of city ride and 30% of highway ride and that should give us the number so let me take back take you back to the fuel station where i filled the fuel yesterday I am at the fuel station now to fill the fuel in the RS457. As you can see, the fuel is almost at empty. It does not even show any range. Since the last full tank, I have ridden it for 304.6 kilometers. On the console, it shows an average of 121.4 kmph and a max speed of 130 kmph that I achieved at uh, 6,500 rpm. So let's go ahead and fill the fuel. Again, what I'll do is I'll fill the fuel completely up to the brim like how i did last time and now we will calculate the mileage as you can see the fuel rate over here is 107.41 full tank dal do let's see how much it accommodates zero so we got 13.04 liter that is exact 13 liter in 1400 rupees and on the console it shows 304 kilometers now 304.6 divided by 13.04 we will get to know the mileage so ultimately we got a mileage of 23.35 kilometers per liter that is not less for a 400 cc bike which has a parallel twin engine with a 270 degree crank and producing about 43 newton meters of torque because on the duke 390 i used to get somewhere around 25 to 26 kmph in the city and considering this has uh, quite amount of more uh, power and torque when compared to the duke 390 23.5 kmph is not at all a bad mileage it might drop if you are riding it very aggressively or it might improve if you are just concentrating on the highways so this was the mileage test before the first service i will make another video after the first service i am done with close to 700 kilometers on this bike remaining 300 kilometers will be done and this first service video will be out so in the last 300 kilometers i as, as i spoke i went to office as well so first 5 kilometers of my office ride is a highway ride and then 30 kilometers of a stretch is peak traffic in hyderabad and then last 5 kilometers again i have a open stretch of road where uh, i usually pull the bike uh, over 100 kilometers an hour and also for your kind information i have ridden this bike at 130 kilometers an hour in the sixth gear at 6500 rpm uh, because it was in run in period i could not cross 6000 rpm very easily all the time though i did cross 7000 rpm once or twice in the last 300 kilometers and that's the mileage that the rs457 gives
and i am really impressed by the mileage that this bike is giving let me know your thoughts in the comments below and keep commenting on the channel like my videos to please consider subscribing and i will see you in the next video bye bye